Hello there folks, this is a Let's Play of Left 4 Dead 2. Uh, this is the uh, introduction movie, I'll just let you watch this for a little Report bit. Report unusual behavior. Barricade such a fucking your con artist. Avoid all contact with infected individuals. I like how Rochelle's wearing a Depeche Mode shirt. <laughs> Wait my ass. That's my favorite line in the whole game right here. Kill all sons of bitches. That's, That's my, my facial instructions. Ah, <laughs> oh, Alan. Such a redneck, I love it. This used to be a nice neighborhood! Oh, oh yeah, very scary. Very scary game. This is some grim shit we got ourselves into. <laughs> I, I must have you know from the start, folks, I'm a huge zombie. Huge zombie fan. Maybe the helicopter. Maybe it's made of chocolate. <laughs> is that a racist joke? Couldn't hey, quite where tell. is everybody? Hello? Oh, this is not happening. Anyone here? This is not happening. This is not happening. Aren't they supposed to be saving our asses? So we get to the like evac station and the helicopters leave. Basically all you need to know for the setup is the beginning of the game. Stop the bombing run! All this other stuff is just kinda extraneous information. It's got me! Clowns. Whoever decided to put clowns in this game is a horrific genius because everyone hates clowns. Oh, the chainsaw. Amazing. Simply amazing. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit indeed, folks. That is a lot of zombies. Hey. Kill all sons of bitches, right? That's my official instruction. I have not <laughs> come this far to die now. Oh, Nick, you're so dramatic. Nick, I, I didn't realize until lately, Nick is kind of an kind of an emo person. All right, so this is Jib, and this is a Left 4 Dead 2 Let's Play. I'm going to be playing through the uh, campaign, and if I feel like I might do some of the multiplayer modes at the end of the videos when we're done. But I'm going to be going through the campaigns... Oh! Wait. Didn't mean to do that. I'm going to be going through the campaigns uh, in single player, which means I'm not going to be playing online just because I didn't want to deal with people leaving and raising people's pings with fraps running. So, as you can see here, there are five campaigns currently. We're going to do them in order. Unlike Left 4 Dead 1, they're sequential, which means uh, the end of Dead Center is the beginning of Dark Carnival. They go in order. Um, unlike Left 4 Dead 1, which were just kind of four random campaigns with the same characters. So here we go. We're going to start Dead Center, which is the first of five campaigns. Oh, one thing I didn't do. I didn't choose my character. I always play as Coach whenever I can. He's my favorite in this game. I love Coach. I didn't choose my character. Nah, eh, not that big a deal. Maybe I'll randomly be coach. Cross your fingers, folks. I might. I really want to be coach. Cross your fingers. Let's see who I am. You think they saw us? They saw us, all right, and they're not coming back. Look like it was here. I'm Rochelle. I ain't going back downstairs on R. That's not that bad. Ask me a question. I dare you. Oh, ask me a question, Rochelle. You're so funny. <laughs> You're so funny. Now, normally I don't really play with melee weapons that much, but I'm going to do it in the sake of this Let's Play at the beginning, just because I probably won't for the rest of the Let's Plays. I really don't like the melee weapons, although they are ridiculously powerful. I read some, I read a statistic somewhere that said like one swipe of like a sword or an axe 
is equivalent to about two or three shotgun shells at really close range. So I mean that's pretty impressive. Especially considering how fast you can swing. Oh, goddamn Jackie. Alright. Sorry about that, coach. That was a jockey, one of the new forms of infected in Left 4 Dead 2. Oh, yeah, we see. Gotta, get this fire. gotta, gotta get around this fire. This uh, fire's blocking our way, so we gotta go around. Not a big problem. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm huge, deathly afraid of zombies, but at the same time, cannot get enough of them. You know, people talk a lot of smack when it comes to zombies. Oh god, it's a charger. People talk a lot of smack about how much they think, how cool they think a zombie invasion would be, but I'm, I'm telling you, those people are full of it. We're gonna need these. They would be crying in their panties. Zombies are scary. I haven't picked up any uh, type of throwing item yet, which is kind of weird, like a Molotov or something. I didn't even hit that one, she just fell over. Well, maybe I did, I don't know. There's simply a lot of zombies, a lot, a lot of zombies. It just turned into a British accent for a second. I'm kind of excited, guys, this is my first uh, Let's Play. Hopefully it doesn't suck. If it sucks, you guys gotta tell me. I'm gonna find a new new way to Let occupy my time. Oh, the Magnum. I don't know why I picked this thing up. It's quite helpful as a secondary item, but the Magnum is your only weapon. It's kind of a bad idea. Oh god! Don't knock me off the edge. That would... <laughs> if I'd have gotten knocked off the edge of that, that would have been a horribly <laughs> short let's play of this game. Ah, I should have kept my axe. As you can see, the city is just in ruins. Reloading here. Just kind of has to be expected in a zombie invasion. Oh, here we go, sword. This is only made a funny sound. I think they included this katana for all the weeaboos out there who have just been wanting to attack zombies with a katana all their lives. Fine by me. Probably thought of the idea once or twice. Apparently. Yes, folks. A bio. Shit! It's some sort of nightmare, goddamn zombie apocalypse and shit. Zombie apocalypse and shit, indeed. I love you, coach. So cool. My name's Alice. Hey, name's Rochelle. You? Name's Nick. Don't worry about learning, because I ain't sticking around long. Oh, Nick, you're so emo. A little while longer at least, okay, Nick? Nick is such an emo. All right, this shirt say I've never seen bullshifters. <laughs> what the hell is a bullshifter? I don't know. I don't know who writes this stuff, folks. When I first installed this game, I, uh, I bought it before I had a chance to install it on this computer, actually, and I install it on this really old computer with a 6 series NVIDIA card and at this part where uh, I'll take the shotgun at this part where it's all this smoke I could not see anything it was it was simply just a gray cloud filling the camera it was horrible I'm glad I'm able to play on this machine you know, it's still kind of hard to see but I think that's just the way the game is designed I'm running everything in full settings so They don't give up. And those zombies in the, the hazmat suits are... You can't... They don't catch on fire. If you're wondering what, what these ones are right here. So if you throw a Molotov at them, they can just run right through it. Come on, lower the shotgun. Can't really see where I'm going. Kinda lost. I think I'm going the right way. Yeah, over here. How are you shooting that? Oh. 
Make sure you're not that. Oh god, spitter. <laughs> 